Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Once again, here I am. Destiny's Tarot coming back with a part two. Coming back with a part two, my lovely, lovely collective. This is part two for the What Comes Out read. We have Eagle and Scorpio. So there could be a Scorpio or someone with Scorpio in their birth chart. Collective, all signs, okay? Or they're trying to put this person, like I said in the previous read, part one, in their ego. This person could have Scorpio in their chart. It could be an Aquarius that's behind this. Or someone with Aquarius in their birth chart, okay? We have Sagittarius. We have Pisces here. So this is a part two to the first reading. This is all signs. Alright, I already cleared the energy. Let's continue. We're going to start off using my deck. What's the messages here? We have Pisces, not the father. Somebody here could be in their 30s. Okay, trying to convince someone they're not the father or put this in their head. Trying to convince someone that they lied about a pregnancy. Someone could have, a Pisces could have lied about a pregnancy as well. You're not the father. Okay, something about the month of July is here. Okay, in the previous reading, we um, saw that this Pisces was trying to convince someone else that they were not the father of a child. And um, they, this divine called this person to have some respect. So if this is the same energy, where someone is trying to like get in someone's mind or convince them some way, shape, or form that they're not the father. This Pisces could be in their 30s. That someone lied about a pregnancy. Someone could be living in denial as well. Or something significant about the numbers 8 and 3. And the number 6 could be significant. June. The summertime. Something could also be significant about the summertime as well. The color yellow could be significant. The messages. I wish things could be different. This could be a third party. I can't stop thinking about you. That your person could have got involved with in the summertime. I knew exactly what I was doing, okay? This third party could have did tried to do or is right as of right now trying to do some sort of mind magic on your person to get them to view you differently or view the situation in regarding you differently or this is what you're doing to someone else apply the rose how they fit take what resonates leave what does not these people or this person could could want to humble you because they see that you are someone that is very confident, a go-getter, you're ambitious, you can build something from the ground up if you want to, you enjoy nature, you're in, your, you're in this beautiful energy. They're doing, they could be doing this because they want you to be emotionally unbalanced with the Queen of Cups in reverse. They want to they wanna disrupt the, all this peaceful energy that you're in as well. Something about the summertime, about you guys going outside, enjoying nature, that bothers these people or this third party. One second, let me grab my charger loves. There we go. All right, let's continue. Like I was saying, something here about, you know, the summertime that's bothering these people. They feel like, oh, she's going to step out. They want to isolate you, maybe that's what it is, from going outside for some reason. 
but yeah, or in the summertime is when these people are going to try to strike you guys to make you be emotionally unbalanced. It's the messages here. So this is the energy that they see you in. They see you as being the nine of pentacles upright, but the energy that they want to bring you to is the queen of cups in reverse. Someone that is just emotionally unbalanced where they're dangerous to themselves and others. Okay, these karmics are definitely narcissists. They could want to make make you be seen and viewed by other people as someone that is dangerous four of pentacles reverse is here something about your stability guys we have the king of pentacles yeah they want your masculine okay so i'm going to separate this yeah this is one of those so they want your masculine to give up on this relationship with you, to release you, release this home, release this job, release this money. They're doing work. This is spell work on your stability. They're using a masculine, the person that you're, your, your provider, your husband, or just your boyfriend, who, if you, you know, you know, and they're going to use this person to make you be emotionally unbalanced. Okay. Because they feel like they feel like your stability comes from this person, so they're they're gonna, they're using them. These people or this person is very frustrated. Three of Wands in the reverse. They're agitated. They're frustrated because your masculine is the King of Pentacles, and because you are the Nine of Pentacles. Okay, you're working on yourself. You're someone that's very hard working. I see two very ambitious people in front of me, and I see um, a third party that is envious upset pissed off they could be de in desperate need of trying to convince this man that you know you're not the father of a child that you lied about a pregnancy i feel like this is a pisces there's something significant about 38 and the numbers eight and three or three and eight also six there could have been um there could have been some sex that was caught as well between a, a Pisces and your person here. This could have happened in the summertime. This could have happened in the month of June. This person has no regret. They, they like the fact that they slept with this man. Um, they knew exactly what they was doing and they're actively thinking about this man. They could be thinking about this man sexually as well. Yeah, this third party is in desperate need of shutting you up as well if you're talking about this. Or they just want you to just be quiet. They don't want you to talk at all. This third party could be a Leo as well. Because the more you talk, the more they're being investigated or the more you're finding out as well. Could I find the four of pentacles or first the king of pentacles up right? Seven of wands, the magician in the reverse. So, like I said, they're doing work. Their manifestations, their spell work is not working. This masculine is holding on to you guys as tightly as possible, standing on what he believes in and not allowing other people to come and put their three and cents into your relationship, okay? He understands that he is being spiritually attacked as well too and he knows that these people are very deceptive, okay? Or this person is very deceptive. He knows that this Pisces, he knows, okay? That he cannot trust this Pisces. Or whoever this other energy is. Because this person could just have Pisces in their chart. But this person is protecting their relationship, their thoughts, their money. Everything is being protected. This masculine is holding it down at this time. Yes. He's also protecting you guys. Queen of Cups reverse with the Nine of Pentacles. That's my spirit. Yeah, Magician Reverse, Pink of Wands Reverse. So, these people are false practitioners. Whatever they're trying to manifest, they're being seen as false in this masculine's eyes as well, too. And the King of Wands Reverse, yeah, they want your person to just be a womanizer. They want this person to be a big-ass hoe. They're in desperate need, okay, of having your person bully you, especially um, when it comes to your energy, like, just... If, the, if, the, if you try to have a conversation with your person, they want this person to make it completely difficult. No, that's for you to have a conversation with them. They're trying to knock you guys' communication off completely, okay? When it comes to bullying your energy. These people, um, they want this person to view you as someone that is false as well, too. Especially if you're a tarot reader or you're interested in spirituality. 
Yeah, they don't want they want you to be seen as someone that is false. They want you to be seen as someone that is dangerous to yourself and others. They want you to be emotionally unbalanced. Okay, this is what they're in desperate need of seeing this third party. Strength with the three of swords and three of wands with those. Temperance, yeah. They try they want you guys to be quiet about something here, especially if you're into spirituality. They're gonna argue they, they probably want to argue and fight. Um, there's a lot of gossip about you as well. There's a lot of gossip here about you guys. Two of wands. These people could want you to travel for some reason. We have death. And we also have the four of swords. They could want your, you or your person to consider traveling maybe towards them. Okay. They're trying to also um, find, get your person to consider something when it comes to them, maybe dealing with them so they can make sure a cycle doesn't close out. Especially with the I, I, I can't stop thinking about you. I wish things could be different. Yeah. This could definitely be somebody that your person had a sexual encounter with. Quick, fast sexual encounters seven of swords secrets are coming out about this could be a pisces four of swords upright yeah ten of pentacles reverse this could be family members and or friends that's trying to get your person to divorce you guys okay by and they want this person to travel they want this person to consider this this could be a group of people they want you to be quiet because you're 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 exposing this or someone is. Yes. Secrets are coming out about this. Mm-hmm. Yep. These people are losing their mind when it comes to your your marriage. They don't sleep. They they're stressed out when it comes to your marriage, your life. This marriage. Yeah, what else is it? The emperor. They don't like the fact that this person gives to you. Okay, they don't like the fact that this person is has changed. This person is is uh, more mature. They're a good father figure. This is nothing but jealousy. The emperor. The emperor. Nine of cups. Yeah, they want this person to continue to look outside of themselves for happiness and not be a good father figure. They don't want this person to provide for you. They don't want this person to be in control of anything, not even themselves. Yeah, three of cups. This is like a group of people. This is also unhealthy attachments. These people are not healthy to be around this person. This is like a group of karmics and narcissists here. Six of pentacles. Oh, We have the lovers in the reverse. They're trying to ruin your marriage, okay, by by trying to stay between you guys. Like, this could be a third party that's trying to their best to make sure that they stay in the mix here, that this person continue to give to them. This could be a Gemini. They could, they're trying to do this in a, in a strategic way, all right? The lovers reverse. Yeah, two of cups to cause a divorce, a breakup. To a cup for her spirit team. They're in desperate need of seeing this. Yeah, nine of cups upright. I feel like your person has ran away from this uh third party. Because the nine of cups is fast movement. Like this is they could be running. They could have ran away from this third party. Clarify this nine of cups. Yeah, keep nine of cups. They ran away from this third party. They could have literally ghosted this person out of nowhere. Once they realized that this person was in desperate need of trying to break you guys up, yeah, they ran away and they're giving to you or they're coming to give to you, okay? They want to give to you. Not a cups up right. This could also be the reason why this, these people or this third party is trying to fuck with this masculine stability or fuck with you guys' stability. Yeah. Be careful of, of arguments. And gossip. I feel like this person is not engaging in any arguments or, or gossip about you or about the situation. And I feel like because of that, this third party is realizing that, you know what, I probably do need to carry on and move on and leave this person alone because they're not even gossiping with me anymore. They're not even, they're, they're not even, you know, they're being careful when they talk to me. This, this person's plans is backfiring. There's going to be a new beginning here, especially in money, okay? And the, the moon is out. Secret is out about this, like. So this third party, uh, these group of people, they're feeling like, you know what? We need to just 
fall back because, you know, but they're refusing to do this, but they know they need to do it. The moon reverse. They don't, they're doing all of this spell work and they're doing all of this manifestation and they don't have any confidence behind it. Yeah, six of cups. Something about children is here in the past. So like I said before, this could be a backstory for you guys. Something that happened in the past. And it's playing out now. Six of cups. Yeah, we have the five, four, one, two, three, four, five. Five of pentacles here. Something about your stability. These people want to see you left out in the cold. Maybe you and your child or you and your children. Or there's a lot of talk about this. Heavy water sign is here as well with the six of cups. Could be, definitely be a Pisces here. Okay, they're trying to conjure up bullshit and drama and conflict. Um, also competition. They're trying to stir the pot here. Could be friends or family members. Could have the three of cups. Sorry about that, guys. So we have the devil with growth reverse. There's growth here. I feel like these people try to stunt your growth or stunt your person's growth, but there's still growth here. They could have also tried to stunt the growth of a child. The devil reverse. Yeah, and I feel like they celebrated this. Five of swords. There's peace here for you guys. Will of fortune. Yeah, this was going to happen. The tables turned. These people could be trying to force their way into your life. They can't do it by gossip no more and arguments because you're not engaging. So they're, but they're trying to find a way to force their way in. I feel like they're actively attacking your masculine right now to make him spiritually attacking this person. To make him be unambitious. Like, don't, don't feel like going to work. Don't have the courage to go to work. Don't want to work. Don't want to do that. No, don't, don't want to be ambitious. They, yeah, they don't want this person to be in this energy. This could be an older woman that is doing this. King of Pen Knight of Pentacles reverse. I don't feel like it's working. Yeah, all because this person chooses, um, uh, wants this person to make a decision. Somebody is acting like they're God in your life, okay? We have the Queen of Swords reverse. Somebody is very deceptive. I feel like they're trying to make it seem like you guys are this Queen of Wands in reverse. You don't have no confidence. You a hoe. You, you abuse your sacral chakra. You do this. You do that. You need to make a decision. Make a decision. How they going to make a decision? They don't know who the hell you're talking about. Because this Empress energy, big piggyback off in the first reading, this person is the Nine of Pentacles. Even the Nine of Pentacles upright came here. They're trying to force you to be the Queen of Swords in the reverse by lies and gossip. Okay? And then they're telling this person to choose. How can this person choose when he don't know who the hell this is? So this is not his person. You know, you guys are not the queen of wands in the reverse, okay? But they, this person is trying to act like there's some authority, okay? The six of pentacles came out in the reverse in the first reading. This person is definitely abusing their authority. So this could be a family member for some. Or you're also, in the first reading, I said this could be your landlord, okay? My left ear was itching. So yeah, something about your left ear could be itching you as well. Not a pinnacle, reverse spirit team. Yeah, the, the sun reverse. Okay. This third party, these group of people, they're miserable right now. They're they're just trying to think of new ideas right now. On um, how the hell they feel like this is an injustice for this person getting up and going to work. They feel like this is completely wrong. They're, they're not supposed to be doing nothing but fighting and arguing with you guys, and you guys are supposed to be somewhere homeless. That's what this group of people want to see. They're in desperate need to see this. They're attacking your stability. Clarify seven of wands with the magician reverse. Thank you. Yeah, we have the judgment here reversed. Like I said, this is mind magic. They're doing on this man to stop loving you. They want this person to view you as someone that you're not. Like I said before, the queen of wands in the reverse. You don't have any confidence. You're not ambitious. You're lazy. You're, you're this. You're that. They're, it's like they're trying to cut, like infest this man's brain with lies and gossip about you. This person comes and they gossip and they talk shit and they talk shit and they talk shit in hopes that it 
grows in this man's brain like they want to plant seeds in his head when it comes to you to change how they view you to change how they view living with you being with you okay this is wrong this is injustice okay they're trying to manifest it but it's not working judgment reversed it justice reversed it yeah we have the hangman in reverse with the empress more pisces energy this pisces is realizing that you're this empress and that's just that on that okay this per this pisces is also realizing or this person because we don't know if it's a pisces could be a pisces could be a gemini whoever this is they're realizing that they can't do anything to stop you you birth new ideas okay and they can't do anything to stop this birth they're not god this is somebody that's trying to pretend like they are god somebody has a personality problem okay somebody has a complex overall Somebody don't know who the hell they are. They, they literally don't. This is a narc, okay? They're, they're realizing, you know what? I can't do shit to hold this empress back. They know the for a fact to keep that energy over there. They can't do nothing to hold you back, okay? We have karmic. This is a karmic. Who is this hangman energy? Okay, we have this person's in bad health. Because of your twin flame, because of your relationship, this Pisces is in bad health, okay? Somebody here is sick. They can have Z in their initials, first, middle, or last. Eviction. This person wants you to be evicted, when, and, and it's being returned to sender. They're the ones that's going to be evicted. You guys are going to know about it. Ego. This person is definitely someone that's in their ego. The color pink and yellow could be significant, Okay? Soul, soulmate, counterpart. This person, that you, this empress is your soulmate, your counterpart. If you're the empress watching this man, this king of pentacles, this provider, they're your emperor, okay? They're your soulmate. They're your counterpart, spiritually protected. That's what this dumbass don't realize. Whatever they're doing is being returned to sender. 777, in the name of Jesus. Clarify this Pisces energy. Yeah, we have sexual attraction. This is someone... That could be in this person's family that has sexual attraction to this person. We have Gemini again. This could be a Gemini. We have Aries. It could be an Aries. It could be a group of people here. Like I said, a group of people that is sexually attracted to, okay, to your person. They want control over this situation, over you guys. We have Virgo here. Justice is going to be served. It's a lot of people that's in your energy, okay, that need to have some damn respect. And we have the letter D, first, middle, or last. Let's continue. The hangman with the empress. Yeah, eight of pentacles reverse. When this shit backfire on this Pisces, this Virgo, this Gemini, this Aries, when this shit backfire on them, they're going to be like, okay, I get it. I can't do shit to stop this fucking empress. I can't do shit. This person just keep like, God damn. Every minute, this bitch doing something new. When this baby born, they're going to be like, God fucking damn. I can't do sh 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 shit to stop this goddamn bitch right here. This bitch, this bitch here. Oh, okay. Yeah. We have the four of wands. The four of wands is also an omen. As I casually say throughout my reading, this is an omen. This cannot be touched. This is divinely guided, divinely guided, okay? Four wands, 11, 11. That's why the shit keep backfiring because th that's why you're, that's why this person gonna be like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that, that, yeah, that's it. So all these tactics, look at this, three of pentacles reverse. They gonna be fighting and arguing, fighting and fucking arguing. This group of people, all of them are going to be fighting and arguing with each other if they're not already. Because it's like, you y'all can't touch what God put together and y'all are not God. Okay? This person is trying to come in with some type of sexual tactics towards this masculine with the, I knew exactly what I was doing. I can't stop thinking about you. Um... I, um, I wish things could be different. Yeah. For some of you, this is a third party. Or this could be just be this um, 
This could be incest as well. It don't have to be actual sex. It could just be um, incest, the way that they talk to this masculine, this family members or friends. Okay, it could be mental incest as well. The high priestess reversed with the king of wands reverse. Yeah, th these people want you to feel rejected. Okay, they want to they want to cause a tower moment for you, sudden change in your life. Okay, that's the truth. Yeah, I'm on track. You guys know it. You could be a whistleblower, a truth teller as well. Clarify this Ace of Swords, Spirit Team. Yeah, Ten of Swords, is, it's, it's being returned to sender. Okay, Seven of Wands. The fact that this person keeps talking about you and gossiping and telling people that you're not ambitious and trying to plant seeds in this masculine's head or she's not ambitious because of such and such. This person don't even know you is what I feel like. They don't need, this person don't know you. Whoever this is, they really don't know you. They just go bits, go off of bits and pieces and they just, they, they gossip and they lie to the point where they, well, you know how, it's, it's, I forgot, I just heard about it. It's this thing that you can do that people do, but it's it's like politics. That when you lie and you lie and you lie and you lie until the until the lie becomes true, it's it, it's something that you do in politics. But this is real life, okay? Somebody is trying to use what they're what they'll do in politics, and they and they're I'm here in Jamaica, so this person could be Jamaican or something about Jamaica is here. But yeah, oh, you guys are this this is some politics type tactics that they're trying to use in you in your life they're trying to put this person up in there under a, a spell an illusion an illusion that's what they're trying to do to this masculine when it comes to you guys so that you'll be in a never-ending cycle of this person constantly cheating on you bullying your energy disrespecting you treating you like shit okay well this person will lose their job as well too and lose money this is this is this is these karmic plans all out of jealousy. Nine of swords with the seven of wands in the face. Yeah. Ten of cups to, to put an ending to this family situation. To get a divorce going. That's what this person is trying to do. Yeah, page of pentacles to get this person to lose their job. I just said that. Nine of cups with the page of pentacles reverse. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This could be a Virgo. They want this person to travel as well. Yeah, King of Swords. They're, they want you to have some type of mental issues, bad health when it comes to your mental. Because you're someone that's confident. Because you're someone that is beautiful. Because you're someone that is ambitious. They want to cause an imbalance in your money and your life. Clarify this two of Pentacles. Because you're, you don't come off of your throne for bullshit. Yeah, I feel like this person wants you to fight with them as well. I feel like this is who's having the this older woman or whoever this Queen of Pentacles is towards Virgo Capricorn. Okay, they're going through mental issues. They're having a fall from grace. Could be an Aquarius. They're doing all of this spell work and they don't even have any confidence to do it. They're shallow. They're a cheater. <laughs> they're projecting themselves onto you guys. Who they really are. They could be stealing money as well. Scamming, I'm hearing. The star reversed to a pinnacle. Yeah. Seven of fucking cups upright. They're trying to figure out why the fuck is this magic not working. Nine of wands reversed. There's no communication between him and this third party, I feel like, or him and these people right now. There's either little to you know, communication or no communication. I know they're not fucking. They're not. Yeah, nine of wands. This person is trying to do some type of sex magic as well. Nine of wands reversed. Three of pentacles reversed. It ain't happening because this masculine is not interested. Seven of wands reversed. Six of wands reversed. I'm sorry. It's a fail. It's a no. Yeah, this person is trying to come in with some sexual energy towards this person and hopes that this person accepts this offer and they're not going to. They're gonna leave, they're gonna leave this person feeling defeated and stupid. Yeah, could be a Virgo with the Hermit here. Yep. I feel like this masculine could also be someone that's in Hermit mode. Nine of Wands reverse. Yeah. Clarify. Yeah, what's the outcome? We got a Page of Wands as the outcome. So these people is stalking and watching this masculine. Okay? And you guys. King of Cups here. With the Queen of Swords. All right? 
They're stalking and watching you. They, if you, if you are a tarot reader or a spiritualist, just know these people are definitely watching. All right, they're watching, and they're stalking your home. Incarcerated is here. These people could be facing jail time as well, or they just want you guys up in your head. They want this masculine up in their head. They could be. They go and they plant seeds in this masculine's head about you, and they gossip about you to this masculine, and then they stalk and watch him, his behaviors and. What he do every day to see if it's working, if he lost his job yet, to see if he um if he's cheated on you yet, to see if he, you know, what is he doing, to see if he's bullying you guys yet, if, if he's, you know, doing what they're trying to manifest. We have C, something significant about the letter C, Libra. This could also be a third party that this person was dealing with, that he ghosted, that is stalking and watching you. Okay, so be careful. Miscarriage. Somebody is trying to see if you guys had a miscarriage yet. 49 and the numbers 9 and 4 or 4 and 9 could be significant. Also 7. The color yellow could be significant. Something about the month of Ju um, July as well is significant. We also have S, the initial S, first, middle, and last. You are the father of this child. Okay, if this empress is pregnant, you are the father. All right, we have 29. That's significant. We have divine masculine. Yes, you are the father of that child. Okay, what else is here, spirit team? We have Pisces again. We have Leo. Compulsive liar. Cancer. When it comes to a cancer, okay, this baby could be a cancer. There's a Pisces and a Leo that are literally lying their ass off, okay? Something about the number 27 is significant when it comes to this. We have the letter A the, and August is significant. The letter K is significant, low loyalty. If there is somebody in your life with the initial K in their name, first, middle, or last, nickname, this person has no loyalty towards you, okay? You, have, you could have Libra in your chart. Or it's a Libra. What else is here, Spirit Team? Yeah, one night stand. Somebody could want to or had a one night stand with your person. We have sexual addiction. The color blue is significant. Close this out, please, Spirit Team. A fugus, and we have the letter V. That could be significant as well. First, middle, or last. We have Aquarius and we have 25. Okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have 40. The numbers 4 and 0 could be significant or 0, 4. Also, April. Let's pull some more hidden truth messages before we close out the reading. Some messages to spirit team. I wish I could share my good news with you. Yeah, this there's a third party that is extremely trying to find any way to talk to this man. My life is not together as it seems. Yeah. This man is very stressed out because there's a third party that is constantly trying to talk to them. I want you. They want you to know that they want you. They want you. I regret lying to you. This person regrets lying to you about something here. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Sometimes this person doesn't sleep. I know that I crossed the line with you. I'm starting to understand our connection, okay? This man is starting to see the truth. Finding out the truth crushed me, and that's just that, okay? So this man that you're dating, they know for a fact what's going on as well, too. They could be highly sensitive now, when it comes to this spell work or when it comes to what someone is doing, everything is starting to make fucking sense here. All right. As the outcome, though, you guys are being stalked and watched. I, um, I feel like gang stalking is going on for you for as well, too. I feel like these people see you guys as a whistleblower and they see your man as someone that is mature. Someone that is more you faithful, a provider, someone that is upright in the King of Cups. That's how they see you guys. They feel like you're a truth teller and you're a truth seeker. Yep. They're stalking and watching to see if their plans are working. And they're going to realize 
that it ain't working and that everything is being returned to sender tenfold. Okay? I'm going to pull some time frame oracle messages. Some messages here for my collective. We have before the end of the summer months. Okay? So you guys could be finding out some information before the end of the summer months. You're going to find something out. Let's see what's going on sexually in this energy. Let's get some sex positive tarot messages. Let's see what's going on for the team. What's the messages here for this energy from this third party? I feel like somebody needs to be honest. They definitely could have had a threesome or had sex with someone here. They need to be honest. Okay, we have question yourself and we have empathy. We also have transgender. So somebody could have gotten involved with someone that is basically transgender. This person could be um, questioning whether or not they're gay. Okay, with listening here, I felt like they could have got head from this person. Or they had sex. Yeah, exhibitionism. Somebody here is very loose. Secrets out about it. Yeah, we have safer. They could have had um, BDSM style sex. Also, with a Pisces, with this moon energy. Someone here that is very loose. Someone here could def definitely be doing sex uh, magic. Or, or touching themselves, thinking about someone sexually. Pride came out. I mean, workshop came out in the reverse. They didn't receive any money from this. This was just something that was talked about, okay? And that they had sex with this person. We have body positive. This person is someone that they're sexual. They like to have sex, but they're they're not confident. They don't have any confidence. Okay, could be an Aquarius. Someone here could like pussy and dick. It could be this person that's transgender, asexual, reverse. Yeah, your person is not asexual, but they have sex, assertivity with someone that is asexual. Could be a fire sign. Yeah, we have ass in the reverse. So somebody here is not gay, but they could have got like forced into having sex with someone that is gay. Someone that was wearing a mask the whole time. They could have walked into, they could have got bomb, bomb rushed. Like they could have went and found out that, you know, this person is someone that's gay. Damn, I didn't know that this was someone gay. And this person was like, yeah, we still going to have sex. So they could probably like rough house this person. And forced them to fuck them. Okay. And at the end of the day, they gave this person head and they had sex with this person and they liked it. With edging here. They had good sex with this person. Yeah. We have Tantra. They could have made love to this Pisces here. Yeah. Somebody could have forced them to do it. Anything else, Jason? Yeah, we have boyism. This is someone that is very loose. This is someone that has sex. With any and everybody. This is someone that they does this, okay? I feel like this person is desiring your person at this time. They want to meet up with your person. They want this shit to go to happen again. You could be finding out that this happened last summertime and you could be.